Today I'm back in that uh, garden I searched last year. This is my last chance to find the dad's gold ring that he lost. I think he lost it 11 years ago, something like that. But uh, I've lined and pinned it. I've got my small head on. Uh, maximum sensitivity, so. See how I get on, fingers crossed with it. I mean, I might find two gold rings. I can have one then. <laughs> anyway, get back to you. Just found my first coin. Oh, first two coins. One's an old apney. Yep. George V. The other one. He's old apney again. Elizabeth. Anyway, see what else there is. Look at that gold ring again. Fingers crossed. Looks like another coin there. Do one of them. Never mind, let's carry on. This one was a bit iffy. Hold off pants, let's carry on. Last time I did this guide it was with the 705. I've just been all the way up there to the top, all the way down this one. <coughs> I've had four coins so far. Looks like this is a fifth. I don't know what that is. Yeah, I'm uh, at the end of the runway by Birmingham Airport. <laughs> um, don't know, I'll have to have a close look at that one. It looks a bit interesting, that one. Anyway, let's see what else there is. Get back to you. Thought I'd got another coin then, but oh, it's just an electro thing. Hmm. Okay, let's carry on. Coin there. I think I know what it is. And it's another half pence. See what else is part of a locket by the looks of it. When I first wiped it, I thought it was gold. I don't know. Let's carry on. See what else it is. Just pulled that out the hole there, about 8 inches. Can't see what the pattern is on it. But it's in here. Oh, looks like an old sixpence. Nineteen fifty-six. Hmm. Okay, let's carry on. Just took a bit of silver paper out there, but our American friends like finding these. On marble. Well, not that old. Probably sixties. Hmm. See what else there is. Just had something there. I know what. I don't know what that is. I always find a lot of cars in it in the last two ones. I think that is a, a shell petrol station pump. Toy one. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Something different. Oh, let's clean that up. Look forward to clean that up. Yeah, an old shell by the looks of it. Okay, let's carry on. Oh, good. Looks like a bit of shrapnel. Which don't surprise me at all. Because Birmingham City's just four mile down the road. 
Okay, let's carry on. Another coin just flipped out from there. I think it's just another eight me. Yep. Old eight me. Uh, what they call ship eight me. Okay, almost at an end now. Let's carry on a bit longer. Coming to an end now. Just got this bit to do. But I'll have to keep away from the fence because it's all paper. I think I've just had another sherry spudge. Yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> and they used to play cowboys and Indians on here. The brothers. I've got another signal in that all there. I'll go and check that now. Uh, sherry spudge. Good. Let's see what's in the other one. Just took the sod out. Looks like a bit of bad pinpointing. Got a idea now on the last hope of the uh, lost the ring down here. Uh, I just had a looks like an old bracelet or something. Looks Victorian actually. Ok, let's carry on. If there's anything else, just down this little bit. Get back to you, there is. I see. Shot me bolt today. Good look. Good two little hours there. Quite a few finds, actually. Well, I say quite a few. The 7 out of 5 done its job before. I shan't be coming here again because the house is being sold now. So, I didn't find the ring. So, it's gone forever. Um, so, as always, again, thank you to all my subscribers for your comments and support. And I'll see you, I'll play in a bit of pasture next time. <laughs> okay, catch you again, I'm gone. Welcome to Magic Wands. We're in the Guardian of England again today, Worcestershire. Off on a clodhopper's dig. I'm here with William. <clears throat> Morning. Thank you. <laughs> Just looking at this orchard here. Be a nice little orchard to do. A lot of look at that. Might pop in after and ask. Old house at the back there. Weather don't look too promising, but who cares? Remote detecting. <laughs> anyway, I'll get back to you when I get there. Catch you in a bit. We've arrived. Beautiful area again. Another good turnout. As always with the clodhoppers. <laughs> I'll get back to you if I find anything. Just started from the car there. Very first positive signal. I think it's a button, yeah. Just a button, but a good sign, I suppose. <laughs> if that's how you want to look at it. Okay, let's carry on. Got a signal here. Looks a bit silvery. Oh, it's a silver thimble. Yeah, silver thimble. Shame it's a bit squashed. A good sign, though. Let's carry on. Something there, or a positive signal. No, nothing or anything. Or oh, some kind of clasp. Yep, have a look later on. Let's carry on. 
something in there that come up around 12.35. See what it is. Maybe a coin ball. Or maybe not. <laughs> Hang on, I've lost it. Oh, I've got it. Oh, it actually looks like a coin. It is a coin. It was a coin ball. Thought it was silver for a bit, but I don't think it is. Anyway, I want to carry on here because it looks promising. So we'll have a look later. Get back to you. Lovely Georgian mansion there. They're all scattered round now. I think I've found a, a folded coin, maybe. Oh. I don't know. Some kind of tag. And I've looked later anyway, let's carry on. The mist's clearing a bit now. I think I've just had a coin in there. It's not a button. Something on there, hopefully. We'll have a look later. Let's carry on. See what else there is. Something in there. Goldy colour, but it's not gold. See, it's a button. Oh, there's nice button ones. Hold it, mate. Nice one. Okay, let's carry on. Where there's buttons, it's coins. <laughs> yeah, just flick that up with a pinpoint. I think it's a coin. Kind of token, I think. Is it always to George? I might be a George. Anyway, I'll have a look later. Just uh, <coughs> the I thought I'd show you that, anyway. We'll have a look at that later. Let's carry on. Just slipped your coin up from down there. I'd say about 11 inches. And I swear it looks like a new penny. Yeah, it's 20 pence. It's a modern 20 pence. How the hell do you get that deep? Oh well. Bloody thing. Let's carry on. I think I'll just had a musky ball. Yep. Hmm. Somebody probably fired it from the window of that house. <laughs> anyway, carry on. Let's see what else there is. And there is something else. Using the uh, 15 by 12 search head this morning. Coverage on it, ground coverage is fantastic, and the pinpointing I've got no problem with at all, none at all. Let's see what the results are at the end of the day, but it's looking good for it. Okay, let's carry on. Just had a small target there. Oh, damn, I thought it was a small coin. It's a button. Tiny button. Never mind, let's carry Stop on. Stop this signal, about 8 inches down. And that looks to me... Well, part of a fibula. Fib, fibula brooch. I don't know. Might be better when it's cleaned up. Let's carry on. Just having a short break and having a look round. 
we've got some more fields to do later on today. But I'm not done too bad off this one actually. Yep, nice area again. Anyway, let me break and I'll get back to you. I don't know where uh, William's got to. I'll get back to you. Catch you later. Um, I mentioned this um, 15 by 12 search that I've had off uh, Crawford's. I ordered it the one day and it came the next, which is brilliant. But I'm quite impressed with it actually. I'm really enjoying using it. It doesn't seem to miss a lot. And when the box came and I picked the box up, have you ever picked a, a kettle up you thought was full of water and it's empty? Let's see it was, because I was told they were heavy, but it's not heavy at all, and the pinpointing is bang on. I can't fault it. Can't fault it. Early days, but on this pasture, it's brilliant. So, thank you to Crawfords. <laughs> so if you need any friendly advice, or you want to chat about metal detecting, give Crawfords a buzz. I'll put a link on after for them. OK, I'll get back to you. Coin or button, we'll see. Button. Never mind, let's carry on. Something in there, looks like an old chest piece. I don't. Have a look later, let's carry on. Just left that field there, tummy break in here, ancient woodland. I'm coming to an end of a day now. <sighs> yeah. I think I've uh, shot my vault again. Oh. But anyway, as always, a big thank you to all my subscribers for your comments and support. And you know, I'm pleased with this 11 inch, an 11 inch idiot. With this 15 by 12 inch <laughs> uh, searched, and I'm looking forward to using it again. But for today, I've had enough. <laughs> so, till next time, take care. I'm gone. This is the problem we got. Second now. Right? Second go left. Oh, it's automatic. <laughs> <laughs> it's terrible coming in. A good job the rain stopped when it did. Looks <laughs> like he's out. I'll probably meet him further up. <laughs> good.